Welcome to USMLEFastTrack.com. The section we're going to talk about today is from First Aid for the USMLE Step 1, 2013 edition. Page 199. Now let's move on to the next pathway, which is the alternative pathway of complement system. Now as we mentioned earlier, that the alternative pathway is activated when the system recognizes the microbial surface molecule. So this is the way the system will detect the bacteria and start the alternative pathway. Now in this pathway, you're starting off with C3 protein. C3 is an abundant protein that is found in your plasma, and this C3 protein will spontaneously hydrolyze to form C3B and C3A. C3A gets released in the system as an anaphylatoxin, and as we mentioned earlier, an anaphylatoxin is what mediates anaphylaxis if the anaphylatoxins are in great number. Now at this point, you are left with C3B, which has to combine with something else. So for this, you have another plasma protein called factor B. Factor B is going to get cleaved by factor D. This will form factor BB, which is written in your books as factors big B, little b. And then this factor BB will combine with C3B that we had left over, and this will form C3 convertase. And this C3 convertase is a different C3 convertase than what we mentioned in the classic pathway, because this C3 convertase is made up of C3B and the factor BB. Now this C3 convertase will cleave more of that C3, which is abundant in your plasma, and that leads to the formation of more C3A, which again we mentioned is an anaphylatoxin, and more of C3B. Now this C3B that is now made will go back and combine with that C3 convertase, which will now give you C5 convertase, which is made up of C3B, factor BB, and another C3B. The C5 convertase will then cleave C5 and form C5A and C5B. The C5A gets released in the system as an anaphylatoxin, whereas the C5B will act to initiate formation of the membrane attack complex. So for this, C5B will combine with C6, C7, C8, and C9, and it will form the membrane attack complex on the cell membrane of the bacteria. So when this membrane attack complex is formed, it makes a hole in the bacterial cell membrane, therefore killing the bacteria. For more information on this topic, click on the link in the description section below. For a full USMLE Step 1 review, be sure to check us out at usmlefasttrack.com where we help you review the entire first aid for the USMLE Step 1 with high quality videos and hundreds of detailed pictures for a better understanding of the material. So to learn from the best USMLE review book, be sure to check us out at usmlefasttrack.com.